Hello my lovely people, welcome back to my channel. I greet you according to your time and the time you are seeing this video. We are still on the gist from the palace of Oni of Ife. Uh, from the look of things, uh, it is like this uh, Oni of Ife sisters, they have kind of repented or they have realized, let me just use the word, they have realized their mistakes and uh, they are ready to make amends since they find out that uh, their brother is going down by the day as a result of uh, their contributions to his marriage with all the solo is because from what we heard allegedly they said these women uh, join force together to bring some of these solo who are giving their brother headache every now and then to the palace because of their greediness they said those times uh, Maria was busy sponsoring them, giving them money, buying them gifts, and they were, uh, their faces were covered from seeing who Maria truly is, you know, and they were busy supporting Maria and uh, fighting Queen Naomi because they believed then, you know, that Queen Naomi have nothing as her then. Uh, they believe that they are not getting anything from Queen Naomi. You know, in terms of uh, gifts and the uh, monetary aspects. But come to think of it, they are the ones who are supposed to be get, uh, uh, giving Queen Naomi gifts. Because for a, for a woman to leave her father's house to come and become a part of your family, it simply means that she loves your family. And she should be appreciated and not uh, the other way around. You know, but no, they were busy fighting her. Because they believe uh, she's not giving them anything. Because as I, I wouldn't say she was insulting them. Because there have never been a video I heard that the Quinomi insulted the Uni sisters. Or Quinomi uh, fight against them. No. But the only reason they supported all these other Oloris were because of what they were getting from them. But now they have realized that uh, no, uh, these people are not what they claim to be. And they are... If, if we did not do anything about this whole thing now, uh, it is going to bring down our, they are going to bring down our brother and uh, destroy his life. And even their brother's attitude towards them can now tell them that, look, oh, they have to be very careful, especially with all these women right now. So, some time ago we heard that uh, they went to apologize to Queen Naomi to forgive them for all they have done to her because they really fought her from what we heard, because we don't live in the palace. They were busy supporting all these other Oloris, fighting Queen Naomi. You know, Queen Naomi that they are supposed to be protecting. Queen Naomi is just a baby compared to these women. Uh -huh. And it is supposed to, they, they are supposed to be the ones protecting Queen Naomi from all these end-time Oloris. But because they are the ones who brought them or who helped them to enter the palace, that is why they don't know what to do at a point. And they get to a point where they don't even talk about the marriage, the palace again. They will just be hiding the, their shameful face, especially when they now realize that uh, these women, they are dangerous and they can buy their brother if care is not taken. So they said that period when these women came, you know, especially when the king married them newly, during December, that should be December last year, they said these three women, the king uh, on his sisters, they went for shopping for all the Oloris. We do know that they are royalty and they know all the most of the things that uh, royal women need. So they went and bought them both beads, uh, scarf, clothes, and everything royalty needs. They said as, as the, the ones they can afford, they bought it for the Oloris, of which we know that they are buying it in return because they are going. those ones are going to appreciate them. By maybe giving them money or even giving them back what they spent on buying those things. They said that is what they did exactly last year. And the Oloris we are rejoicing, celebrating that they are welcomed in the family. And the, the uh, women in the family also loves them and appreciate them. You know, not knowing that they were busy buying a uh, face. Trying to be friends so that they will be getting things from those people. But now that they have realized that uh, they are gradually digging their... A brother's grave and if nothing is done about it they will watch those women push their brother into that grave they have turned against the women you know now what we hear what we keep hearing is that they fought with Mariam 
they uh, fought with Ronke. Uh, they fought with the Ashley. You know, especially those ones that uh, more dangerous than the others. I'm not saying that the other ones are innocent too, but these three, they are the main problem in that palace. So from what we are hearing now, right now, they said they went for shop. They went on shopping for Queen Naomi and Prince Tadenikawa, and they got a whole lot of goodies, good things, you know, for them. And they brought it back to the palace, and they were showing their brothers, you know. Uh, see, oh, see what we got for your wife. We really, we are really sorry. We want to use this to go and beg her to please forgive us, and uh, come back to the palace. That we really miss her. That the way she was uh, around, things are not the way they are right now. They said the way they were praising Queen Naomi in the presence of the king. The king was surprised. I was asking himself, is this really happening? And at the time, it looks as if there is something that is uh, closing all their eyes both the Oni sisters and the king, you know. But this time around, it's like uh, God have used something to wash their face and wash off all those kayamatas so that they will see the truth. And now they have seen the truth and they are, not, they are now uh, fighting those women, making sure that when Naomi returns back to the palace. Anyways, uh, uh, even if they start today to behave well and do as daughters, because one thing I know about daughters, good daughters in a family is that they will always want to make peace. They don't uh, side for anyone when crisis comes like this in a family. They don't go and support one person. They will, they will come and say the truth. If the person is the one, the fault, and they will tell you, look, this is the way you are not getting it right. Then they will tell the other person, this is the way you are not getting it right. But instead of these people to do that, they were busy supporting uh, those ones that they will get something from. It's not as if they cannot get anything from Queen Naomi because, but Queen Naomi is there as a wife. Queen Naomi is not a concubine trying to become wife. But because these ones are concubines trying to become wife, they are now impressing everyone. Even if it means buying their way inside the palace, of which that is what they did. They, they bribed the Oni sisters, they bribed the Ifa uh, priest, they bribed everyone who cares to be bribed to enter the palace. But now, I believe they have learned their lessons. That is if they are going to learn. No. I believe the Oni sisters, they have learned their lessons. And that is why they are now uh, going to after Queen Naomi and doing everything by getting her all those gifts they said it's her Christmas gifts and all of that anyways uh, if it is true it's a good thing mm -hmm. at least I just pray that Queen Naomi will accept and uh, forgive them of course Queen Naomi will forgive them because of the type of a person she is but if they did such a thing to Maria hmm, or some people they might not even forgive them but anyway uh, peace is fine in every family just, I saw it, they said they wanted to surprise Queen Naomi and Prester Denica. Well, they bought a lot of things and showed their brother. Their brother also uh, accepted it and loved what they bought for his wife and son. But the fact is, is Queen Naomi going to receive it from them? That we don't know. Let's just watch and see if she will receive it, you know. I pray she do, so that uh, there will be peace. And love again. I believe if she have finally decided to return back to the palace, she might decide to collect those things, even if she might not use them. Okay, that is what I think. I don't know what to think. What do you think? Whatever you think, please share with us on the comment section. Uh, thanks for watching. Don't forget that they are all alleged information. Okay, bye for now. Love you guys.